because a lot of people seem to want to see other people's downfalls or misfortunes. In today's reaction, we are back on the Filipino band SB19. Now, one of the most popular requests that people have asked me to do since doing Gento, I think that's how you say it now, is a song called Bazinga. I ain't got a clue what this is, but one thing's for sure, these guys rock. Let's check this out. Right, in between putting my headphones in, I had a quick Google of what the word Bazinga means, and it means, basically, to rub a joke in someone's face. Right, okay. I'm looking forward to this then. Let's get it. SB19 Bazinga. Let's see some jokes rubbed in faces. And the space might not work. It's in English. <laughs> I'll keep the subtitles on just in case they switch the languages a bit like Easy Mill does. Right, okay. They want all the rubbish in the world to stop being the way it is. They want everyone to get along, everyone to be happy, basically. You know, it's a curse. Right, okay, let's run it back in. It threw me off guard because they were singing in English. Buzz killer, I will kill your buzz. <laughs> all these people who are hating. This is another hater song. I, oh, no, he's got a Joker card. Clown, who's the boss? No, that's the next line. Um, yeah, so obviously they're going back in on the haters, all the people who say that these guys are no good, or maybe they're trash, or maybe, you know, maybe the image of them. I don't know. I know I'm, I've noticed a lot of these bands that do sing about haters are normally berated in the press, berated by fans. Well, not, well, Plastic fans, fans that are fake fans. Rival band fans. You know what I mean? A lot of people give people hate and, you know, the, the best way to address it is through your music. And if you're still going to be successful, even though you're getting a lot of hate, then, you know, good luck to him. If you're getting hateful comments as well as getting good comments, you're still getting comments. You're still getting notes. You're still getting put in the news. You're still getting, you know, lifted up. Or even the trolls help your image. <laughs> Let's go. You cannot get to me. I have got the Almighty with me. I believe in God. I have got all this power. I don't care what you say to me because I'm true to myself. I've made it. You know, I mean, how the hell are you going to affect me? Because you don't. I'm just addressing the fact that you're not getting under my skin by making a song about it. Get to me, get to me. When I get the almighty with me, the baby day, baby day. Every day, I think it's the catchy Lord chorus. gets heavy. Yeah. Throw it away. The world has no hostility. Is there a way to break the curse and stop this? Mm. Yeah. Go throw stone in my break a bone, but be right with me because I won't condone. What a message. I also like that line where he says, Bazinga, your hate is like gasoline, which means obviously it's the fuel to our fire. The more hate we get, the more we re retaliate, the more we get bigger. You know what I mean? That's what I was saying before about even bad press lifts the profile of an artist or a group or a band or whatever. You know what I mean? If, if you're in the news being talked about, if you're in the media being talked about, Good or bad, you're getting lifted. Doesn't matter because people are talking about it. And in fact, hateful comments tend to go viral easier because a lot of people seem to want to see other people's downfalls or misfortunes. But I like the fact that these guys address it and say it's making us bigger and we, we, we're proud to what we are. 
proud of what we are. You know what I mean? Good. Let's go. It's a stance. Good on him. Oh, do you know what? Every single one in this band has got a different style of flow and it's brilliant to hear because I do like rap music myself and I, I love seeing new artists that do rap as well as singing and stuff. It's brilliant. It's fantastic. Love it. You know what we're doing, what you're saying. Yeah. People want to watch the world burn. That is a sarcastic, oops, I'm sorry. You know, I can't help the fact that we went big, that our band went massive. You know what I mean? Why do you have to criticise? Because I'll tell you why, because a lot of people in the world, a lot of them, just want to watch the world burn, taking taking words from the Dark Knight. <laughs> right, let's go. Well, Alfred from the Dark Knight. <laughs> He's on fight as well. Oh, wow, that's good. Cool moves there. Ray Robotic. Look at you, look at you. Wow. And they don't uh, play the game. <laughs> nice. Oh, nice way to portray knocking the haters out or taking away their power by saying that SB19 wins in a video game scenario. Obviously, SB19 versus the hate. I also love the line, though, it says, I'd, I'd beat you even if I didn't know Kung Fu, etc. Because that's just saying, I'm going to fight till I die to be good at what I do or to be successful in my band with my friends, you know what I mean? It doesn't matter what you say, you'll never knock us down. Look at you, look at you, you know what I mean? Why are you some one of these people who is so adamant that you need to knock people down? You know what I mean? Why are you one of these people who have to hate? Why do you have to criticise, etc.? Because people do. And they're sad. Them people are just sad aces. I really, really enjoyed this. I enjoyed the message. I enjoyed the song. I enjoyed the choreography. Some of the moves in the dancing and stuff was absolutely fantastic. I'm liking SB19. Where should I go from here, guys? Let me know in the comments. And if you like my videos, then please hit like and subscribe. And I shall see you all in the next video.